<laughs> it has to be the only way that this man has been. Mm. That has to be the only way this man is married to her. Besides the fact that he loves her, but. <laughs> I was about to say, yeah. <laughs> besides the fact that he loves her, but, you know. Mm hmm. I still can't get over the fact that you called it a breadstick. I love it. <laughs> like, she's, she's built, she's built, like, all the gardens fucking, um, never-ending fucking breadsticks. <laughs> uh, <laughs> sorry. I shouldn't be laughing that much. It just caught me off guard. <laughs> Oh my god, Timmy and Dolores are in the fucking kitchen. They're blocking everything. I got this, I got this. Let's do this. I don't know. I'm just gonna pop in serotonin before I uh, lose my shit. I'm so glad I didn't make Timmy, get the fuck out the way. <laughs> I swear. Popped in some serotonin mm -hmm. into my AirPod with music. Mm -hmm. I and have CPRE and playing. Yes, good choice. It, he'll counter, he'll counteract the amounts of depression I have on the way. Come on, two, three, four. Okay, I got the four cans. Oh, I I can beat this. I can beat this. Hold on, hold on. Get you. No, go, go, Timmy. Go, go, go. Timmy. Again? Did you get stuck on Timmy? Timmy, I did. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> All I had to do was run to the kitchen and back. Oh. <laughs> Oh, but okay. Last night, after I pulled my hair out on this game and said goodnight to you, I was like, huh, I wonder if they announced Elden Ring on um, E3. So I checked some of the new announcement stuff, and that's when I saw Final Fantasy 16, and it's also when I saw Elden fucking Ring finally has something. After two years of waiting for it, it finally has a release. Oh, did, oh, did you beat it? No. Oh, okay, because I saw you jump in and I was like, oh, did you beat it? Okay, now yeah, okay. Is that umbrella? Does it? Okay. Honey, you want to go to like. straight down to the bedroom. Mm. Yeah, that's a good choice. Like, get, get all the slow ones out of the way first. But, honey, if you don't get your javelin shaped ass out the fucking way. No, that's just hard to get out of the way. Yeah, she built like a javelin. Okay, the kids are in here, so that means they're not gonna be 
much of a distraction. Okay, Timmy's in his room. Sorry, he's vibing, no context. Okay, Timmy's in his room. He said he'll be out of his way. And Dolores is in her own room. Good. Oh, wow. I'll, oh I'll, my god. I'll, no! I can't. I can't make it. Fuck! I just needed four more. I I already have a headache. <laughs> I just got here. I felt that. You know what? I'm gonna pull up the frap. Because I didn't get to drink it yesterday. Oh, yay! Speaking and of I fraps. I love it. Speaking of fraps, I do owe you some fraps. My dad's gonna be like, why are they sending you so much food? It's like, it's not even the food, man. It's just the drinks. Oh, I had. Three cans left, and they're right in front of me, but I ran out of time. I felt that. <sighs> Dude. <sighs> but no wonder, it's... Imagine how many attempts... Even if we just stream this for an hour, imagine how many attempts that is, if all we have is one minute. Ah, oh, so many. Oh. But even I if by chance- I look so dumb! <laughs> yeah, so you look fine. No, I- no, my said I looked in the mirror and all I see is just my uh -huh. little headband uh -huh. that- providing my cushion it uh -huh. looks like there's just like a flat ass cat sitting on my head <laughs> oh, shit, it looks adorable a little flat cat on Not your head even. <laughs> okay my frap is in hand I'm gonna mix that bitch up get okay. that caramel Timmy's out of the way Whoever put the basket there, your mom's a hoe. You're fucking her. Oh. <laughs> My hoe. <laughs> that was four soup cans of left at a time. At some point, I am going to take a break and just do my laundry to de-stress. <laughs> <laughs> I might just de-stress and play Bloodborne. That's how stressful this fucking game is. Uh, I might just try and do taxes or something like. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Oh, Timmy, there's not that many cans. Oh my god, dude! You should have seen the stick drift at that one moment. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, there's three over there. Oh, and I did, and I did already watch your uh, your uh, streams. Uh -huh. While I was going to bed, you were a 60 seconds one, and the second hand stress I got from watching you do the challenge. <laughs> oh my word. I feel like the scream that I will emit is justified. Uh huh. Throw it in! Oh my god. Please start that fucking scavenge. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to yell. But... No, no, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> It, it is f I, I know exactly what you're going through, so it's it's okay. <gasps> I might have enough time. If I'm fast, I might have enough go, time. Go, 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 oh, go, go, Martin, no. go. Went to the wrong room. I thought there were more cans in there. Hold on, I'm gonna pause this bitch right quick. Let me pull up your stream. I'll put your stream on my second phone because someone Snapchatted me on my main. I gotta see who that is. Mm, no, you already responded to me. No, 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 it's, it's, it's a second person, because I just saw the uh, notification pop up, I gotta see who it is. So I'll put you on the second phone, and then I'll move you back over to the main phone when I'm done. Okay, just taking a quick break, quick break. Yeah, sanity break, just to see who it's... Oh, it's Andrea, what's up? Hell yeah. Yes. <laughs>
Okay. Depending on how far I even... Anthony might be going to his dad's today because it is Friday. Mm-hmm. Okay. But the good news is that, that he'll be with us soon, yeah? No. Oh? Because remember, he doesn't take his uh, PlayStations over there. Oh, shit. So we're going... Well, it depends. It depends on mm-hmm. how he's feeling. Okay. But, yeah. Best case scenario, we'll be seeing him this uh, Sunday. Or even just this weekend. Best case scenario. Because I miss this sir. Uh, I haven't seen him in a bit. I miss him too. And I talk yeah. to him damn near every fucking day. <laughs> yeah. No. And besides, without him, we can't play Stardew. So, and, uh, so I'm also missing playing Stardew. <laughs> I was gonna just say, <laughs> fuck that bitch and just go. I mean, we could. Just play some Sardu. It's up to you. Because I'm using That's the That's what way, I was but... gonna do. Because yeah. I was just like, um, no. <laughs> so then he can come back to the kid in his room. Yeah, let No, me no, I'm going to stop right there. Oh? But isn't the kid, like, essentially, like, there? No. Yeah. Okay. Like, do we know when the kid's gonna be born? Uh, it says 14 days after. Mm-hmm. So, we conceived on the 8th. So, so 10 with 18, so on the, on the 22nd is when the kid will be born. So we gotta stop on the 21st. Yes. So we can. <gasps> Fundy, look at my stream. I'm off. <laughs> How am I supposed to get that can? Uh... How am I supposed to get that can? Game? Tell me. <laughs> Fuck this game. This sucks. <laughs> Fuck this game. <laughs> Please don't happen to me. Please don't happen to me. Okay, we're good. That didn't happen to me. Lucky. <laughs> it's whenever I run into that room Lessons. and see that chair, I get nervous. But you know, it's... Oh, and I did attempt another Dead by Daylight match. Uh-huh. This did time... This time I got Michael Myers and... Uh-huh. Like, as the killer. And mm-hmm. it's extremely unsettling working on a generator, looking around, and seeing him peeking around a tree staring at you. It's, it is unsettling. <laughs> I'm aware. And like, he was just staring at me, so I thought, well, is he like trolling me? Because he's just, he's just looking at me, right? And the next no, thing, no, that's I... his whole thing, yeah. Yeah, only, only then did I realize. Wait, is that part of his power? It was. <laughs> that's rough, buddy. Yeah, he's Holy still... shit, this run was bad. That means all those cans of soup are in there. Pick up fat, dude. Ted, r- it, it takes like a second for a Ted to start running. That's annoying. Like, if he just ran when you told him to run, it wouldn't be this bad. He would have finished it by yesterday, but no, he doesn't run when you tell him to fucking run. Tears. Shit. Big fat fucking tears. <laughs> Just pick up the soup. I said I picked up the flashlight. <laughs> oh my god, I might have to go grab my camo controller because this shit is not connecting well. Wait, wait, are you like getting input lag or something? No, like Martin, if you see like the way that when I turn, oh. you just see him just turning even more, and yeah. that's not even because of the fact that he's like I have the rotation. Mm-hmm. At max. Dolores, out of the way. Speed, my boy. Go, 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 go. Out of the fuck out the way. <laughs> kitchen, 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 kitchen. Come on. Come on, bitch boy. So glad fucking I can't hear you, man. Pick up the pace. Pick up the fucking pace. 
Bruh, I have three left and they're all in the <gasps> fucking bathroom. Oh. Speaking of bathroom, I gotta go pick some up. Dude, if I was playing Fuck at the this, Lord's... I'm the controller. Dude, if I was at the Lord's, I bet I could like Spider-Man over the wall, like in between the walls because she's so fucking skinny. No, Are she's the... hella fucking fast. Like, she grabs shit faster. Dude, just let us play Dolores, come on. Let us play Dolores game, come on, let us play Dolores. <laughs> Fuck out the way. Okay, I have my... I have my camo controller in my hand. I'm very mm. depressed that my yellow one's just sitting. I feel like I could just use that controller for whenever my cousin, like my baby cousin that likes destroying shit comes by. Ah, okay. And just hand it to her and be like, here, just mm -hmm. take it. Yeah, it's like, oh yeah, you can like... like... But that's a PS4 controller. No, mm. it's not. It just looks like one. <laughs> oh, oh my god, ah. what? Ted, why do you feel faster? What the fuck, man? Hold on, give me a second to like. Why is your just, kid zooming? I don't know. Maybe it's because of the controller. Hold on. But you, your kid is zooming. Hold on. I don't know why he is. If you beat the challenge now, I'll be very happy for you. I feel like I'm tripping balls though. Dude. Because of how fast he's going. Dude. Personally, I don't even care if I win. As long as one of us wins, I will stop playing this game. As long as one of us wins this challenge, I'm done. Oh fuck. Okay, okay. I just gotta get used to, uh, Ted. Like, on this controller. Uh-huh. Because I wasn't the... expecting him to be that fast. Dolores, fuck out the way. Alright. Has anybody beaten this challenge? Yeah, I grabbed the axe. Yeah, people have beaten it, and what really annoyed me is some people have said that it was the easiest challenge for them. Other people have said that, like, for us, it's, it's the most difficult challenge. So, yeah, there's very different reactions to this uh, challenge. Okay, well, I hope that they choke on a dick. That's about it. <laughs> yeah, because apparently it's very dependent on RNG and your and and just if you're lucky or not, and you know how bad both of our luck is. So, we... <laughs> Lady Luck, please, I I need you to love me today, please. Uh... I need to just make love to Lady Luck today. Uh... Fuck no, Lady Luck just said fuck your controller. Uh, as soon as you're done there, Randy, look at my stream and tell me how I'm, I'm supposed to win with Timmy. I, same, I had Timmy in front of mine and I just said fuck it, I didn't care anymore. <laughs> Dolores, oh wrangle the kids and get them out the way! Uh, no, fuck this, restart this game. Challenge. <laughs> Loser shit to this game. I'm not, I'm not done with this game until I beat this damn fucking challenge. As soon as I beat, as, as soon as either of us beat this challenge, I'm uninstalling this game. <laughs> I am Ooh, done. Why? It's so good though. It is a good game. I, I love this it's game. It's a good game, but it's fucking frustrating. Like, uh, oh, okay. A bit of a, okay, so a, a bit of a backstory to me. I played all of the Soulsborne games, and then I played Sekiro, thinking Sekiro would be easier. Sekiro is the most difficult out of all of them, and I would rather play Sekiro than play this challenge right now. A mood, if have I played, have ever. Have, have you played Sekiro? Yeah. Then you know exactly the pain I mean in, I want, I'd rather play Sekiro than this. And did that... you beat the is a different kind of hell. Yeah. And did you beat the game? Did you beat Sekiro? No, I haven't. Like, yeah. I played it for my sister and my dad, but I never mm -hmm. got around to finishing. Mm -hmm. 
but I can at least guarantee Bye. that that <sighs> what you said right there, I felt that in my soul. I felt that. <laughs> but yeah, it's but I can at least guarantee that you got further than me in Sekiro, because the furthest I got was that dual master in the Hirata estate. That's the furthest I got. I couldn't make it past that. And also, Madam Butterfly, fuck that boss. She can suck me. Horrible boss. Hmm. It used to be me going to my dad to help me for a part of the video game, now it's him coming to me. <laughs> that was, that's a mood. Because when I was a kid on the PS2 and I got stuck on a game, I would always bond at him to like come and help me. And remember the game Astro Boy? Mm -hmm. Yeah, there was this boss that I could never beat on my own. And I kept pestering my dad to like come and help me to beat it. And one day I was like, you know what? No, I'll fight this boss on my own. And I beat it. And from that day, I always enjoy boss fights because it reminds me of that day. Mm. Yeah, and the second have ruined it because that game is one <laughs> very difficult boss fights. <laughs> mm. The the screech I emitted when I beat the um the final boss in Final Fantasy thirteen two. Mm-hmm. That was the most fulfilling mm. screech I have ever made. <laughs> Tell me no, about the boss. because like when it's <sighs> okay. So Final Fantasy Thirteen, you had to do um. So you had to switch through your modes, right? Okay. So there's like Commando, Ravenger, uh, Sentinel, whatever, right? Uh huh. And. and There's three dragons that you have to beat. Okay. One of them you need to use physical attacks on. The other one you need to use magical on. <sighs> and I think the other one's like a combo of off, like the both of them. Mm. But when I tell you that it took fucking forever because when they're close to dying, mm -hmm. they uh, if you don't kill them in a certain amount of time. They retreat and they regain health. Oh, like back to full or like only a little bit? Yeah, back to full. Oh, that's bullshit. And, and then... when I tell you, I cried on several occasions out of frustration uh -huh. is an understatement. And that's interesting because I also, okay, when I'm playing games like Dark Souls, I... I love them to bits, but there are certain bosses where I get so frustrated, I just get very quiet and I cry as well. Like, I don't cry out of anger or sadness, it's just out of frustration. And if they're my most, like, fulfilling defeat of a boss, probably in Neo 2, there's this boss that copies you, so it's fighting a copy of yourself. But he plays you better than you play yourself. But one day I defeated him. And it was midnight. And I literally got up, threw my controller and a headset on the bed and just screamed almost as loud as I can. Get fucked. And I never played Neo 2 again. I haven't touched it since. I felt that. Yeah. And no, was, it was... Yeah. For me, it was 3 o'clock in the morning, mm -hmm. and all you hear, like, I was sitting in my parents' bed, like, my sisters, that, mm -hmm. like, it's my mom, my dad, and then my sister, they just passed out, and there's mm -hmm. just me, uh, playing on the bed, fucking trying to beat this guy mm -hmm. for so fucking long, and uh -huh. then when I finally did, I chucked the controller and said, fuck yeah, at the top of my lungs, and I woke up my parents, oh, no. and I needed a new controller. <laughs> oh no! That was how bad I was holding in the amount of rage. 
<laughs> and they were like, what? What happened? And I was like, I beat it! And they're like, what happened to the controller? And I said, oh. Oh, fuck the controller, oh. I won. <laughs> <laughs> and they were like, you know what, because you won, we can't really, we can't really say shit. So mm -hmm. they were like, just grab the other controller. <laughs> <laughs> and when a, it's split in half, bro. <laughs> oh shit, how, how angry did that boss make you? <laughs> Very. I think Damn. I had to retry about like 50 times. Jeez. If I... I feel like I could have, like, if I was to do it again, I feel mm -hmm. like I would beat him in like the second or third try mm -hmm. now because I know what to oh. do. <sighs> But 50 times? Uh -huh. Fuck. And what was, okay, so excluding that boss fight, what was the boss that just infuriated you the most because of like how either, uh, because of how unfair it is or because of how powerful he was compared to you? Like that boss, who is it? Oh, buddy. Um, honestly? I don't know how to answer that question because there's not another boss that mm. I needed a fight against that was on that level of oh. hatred and anger. So excluding that boss, I in... fucking grabbed the gun. Oh no! Oh no! That was to me as well. Like in the, I guess you could call it the study where the fireplace is. When there's a gas mask and an axe above the can, I get nervous. Because I'm like, if you dare fucking grab that axe or the mask, I will kill you. But yeah, I felt um, that on a spiritual level. The second most, like, enraging boss I've ever fought. It was in Bloodborne. The final boss of the game. The Moon Presence. I'm, like, so the Moon Presence boss. Just to get to that boss, you need to fight, like, five extra bosses. And you have to fight the final boss twice to get to the moon presence. But okay, you go through all that heartache and stress, and now you're fighting the moon presence. I must have attempted that boss also around 50 times. Haven't killed it yet. I have not beaten the moon presence yet. It's a completely optional boss. I, I, can, I can beat the game without fighting the, the moon presence. But I really wanted to fight the moon presence. But I just can't beat it. I could it. never. No. I could never. I feel like I need to beat this bitch into the fucking ground. And you know me. I am a hard-headed son of a bitch. Once I say I'm going to beat you, I'm, 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 I'm going to beat you. But that boss broke Fuck. me. Fuck. <sighs> I had Lena. four left. Axe, if, if you can have the axe, I will annihilate you. I feel like this would be on par. Not on par, but like two, mm -hmm. like four levels down uh -huh. from the, the that final fight that I had in Final Fantasy with Caius and whatever. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and when you fought that final boss, that dragon, like, what, what was your winning strategy to eventually defeat it? What was your strategy? No, I had no strategy. It was just brute fucking force. Oh, uh, okay. It was just if I if I punch you fucking hard enough, one day I'll beat you. It's just I, I, dead I ass. That was it. honestly how it was going because I needed. So I made Null into the Sentinel, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And when they're the Sentinel, they uh, they can provoke. They can make the enemy just purely focus on them. And mm -hmm. that's what I made him do because, you know, it's just extremely difficult for m me to just. Mm -hmm. Where's the other cans? Oh god. All the cans are in here. All the cans are in here. I don't think I can make it. I don't think I can make it. Oh my god. I don't think I can make it. No! There was just three cans! There's a <gasps> Wait, hold on, let me see. Oh no, Wendy. He has three kids! He was so close! Oh my god. Okay, so yeah, I made Null the Sentinel. Mm -hmm. And 
he provoked them so that they're only attacking him and when it was like the ravenger or like the mage mode and then when it came to the commando mode i made it so that the, both of them were commandos and then mm -hmm. i made them um because it's just faster to get the, that one out the way but they attack so heavily that it's just like you need one of them to just you need to sacrifice the turn to heal up mm -hmm. and it hurts Mm -hmm. So it was just constant brute forcing all the way through of just hoping and praying that you were going to make it. I, I like you're watching that timer tick down. I think they also mm -hmm. have a death timer on top oh, of their heads. Great. What, what more did they throw on like, you? Jeez. Like, rub salt into the wound, I guess. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> they were like, hey, so you want to slow it steady this shit now, death timer, bitches. <laughs> yeah, you had to beat that in that certain amount of time, and it hurt so, so, so much. And was it at when least? When you're just looking at that time. You don't have a lot of, you don't have a lot. They expect uh -huh. you to beat it, and like, I think... I think it starts at 5,000 seconds. <sighs> but it, but from your experience, was it a reasonable death timer or was it like... A completely... It was a reasonable death timer, I'll give it oh. that. But, oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, when I tell you that I've actually like not... It was on the like tip of my... ah! How close were you? Two I cans! I had four in my hand. Oh. That was a scream. That was a scream. I'm listening to your thing in uh, my ear. I yeah. feel bad. Cause no, like no. Because I was re-watching the streams while I was trying to go to sleep, and oh. my own scream scared the shit out of me. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of don't feel bad. It doesn't bother me, so it's okay. I know it doesn't bother you, but it's gonna bother me when I wake up tomorrow. <laughs> when I'm trying to sleep later. Yeah, and that's actually a funny story, because I was re-watching it as well, and I think I like... So you know how you're at that state where you're in between sleep and consciousness? Like, you can tell that you're ab like about to fall asleep. Yeah. It was, It was at that moment when you said, Martin! I was like, oh, yeah, yeah, what's up, what's up? I thought you hopped back into a party or something, even though my console was turned off. I thought you hopped back in, so I got like... I flew up, threw my head at all, like, oh wait, no, everything's turned off. Oh yeah. <laughs> Whoops. But yeah, um, when I fought the boss that copies you in Neo 2, and... I, my approach to it as well was just brute force it. One of these fights, you're gonna slip up and it'll beat you. But the thing is, the the weapon that I used was fuck! the... Fuck! How close were you? Two again, two again. Two, fuck. Ugh. But yeah, um, because that boss copies the oh, weapon... Oh, big bug. Big oh. bike. Oh, yeah. uh, keep talking, sorry. Oh. Oh, yeah, it, it, it's okay, but yeah, like uh, because that boss copies the weapon that you use, but it cop, but it, but it like has it at a max rank weapon, so it has all of its skills, but you don't have all of its skills yet. And the weapon that I was using was the katana, and the thing mm -hmm. about the katana is that it's it's a counter attack weapon, so mm -hmm. it focuses a lot on parries and you know guard breaks and stuff. So, whenever he, the boss, would take a swing at me, I can't parry him because he can't parry bosses. But if I take a swing at him, he can parry me because I'm not a boss. So, it was unfair in that I can't parry him, but he can parry me. And how I eventually beat him was just... I just threw out so many attacks, like, he can't parry all these attacks. He might parry one, not all of you them. You know what's really funny? Oh. Can you change your weapon? Uh, yes, he, he can have up to I would have changed the weapon. I would have changed the weapon so that he didn't have a... So that he couldn't parry me. 
Yeah, because I'm gonna go to install Neo too. <laughs> I'm gonna install Neo. <laughs> Neo two, Neo two. Let me go reinstall Neo too. <laughs> I need to go reinstall Neo. Hold on. Where is Neo? Neo two. I need to reinstall. <laughs> I need to go back yet and fight his ass. Yeah. 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 What does it look like? I'll go pull up my own stream and see what it looks like. Oh, that's pretty cool! What? That's cool. Oh, but I need to make some sacrifices. If, if I want to make room for Neo, I need to I need to, to delete something. Fuck. Um, uh, we're not going to play the first Divinity, so I'll delete that. Um, I'm having fun with Empire of Sin, so I'll delete... XCOM? No, but I have a... Yeah, I'll delete XCOM. Piss off XCOM. I doubt that Silas and I are going to play Diablo again, so I'll delete that. I'm keeping Dead by Daylight. Everything else can stay. Okay, we're good. Yeah, I should buy it in, in extend. Three terabytes. I I gotta buy an external for my PS5 thing because I do have a USB slot for it, so I gotta get me a damn. Uh... Okay. On my so... extended storage. <laughs> but Fundy, as soon as you said, why not just swap weapons? It's like the whole galaxy opened up in front of me, like. <laughs> And like, because the weapon <laughs> that he copies is dependent on the weapon that you walk in with, if I walk mm -hmm. in, like, barehanded, and then swap to my katana, I can whoop his ass. I just... Ah, <laughs> smart. Oh no. Oh no. Do you want to know how much of my storage I've used? Uh, 2.5 terabyte? Very, very close. 2.09 terabytes. Oof. That's a lot of storage, Wendy. That's a lot of games. What the fuck is on here? Damn. Okay, oh, and... what is the biggest fucking thing on here? I'm gonna see what game daylight? is the biggest here? If you have I'm... Warzone, I think it's Warzone because Warzone is fucking huge. I don't even. I don't even have a VR. Do, do, you do you have a do you have a VR game installed? I have VR games on there, like Star, oh. um, like the Res Infinite and shit. Because uh -huh. um, my family took my PS4 with them uh, oh. because my one of my uncles has a VR set, uh -huh. and they wanted to try it out and whatever. So yeah, there it was. Okay, I'm getting rid of Anthem. Bye. Yeah, fuck Anthem. That came to bust. But yeah, also, Wendy, um, how do you feel about um, punting Timmy out of the house? Amen. But he's also MVP because he came back with four waters and four food for me. So uh, I can't really. He also came back to me with a gun and ammo, so I can't be too mad. Just looking to punt him out the window. <laughs> uh, I don't really play. Hmm. There's a lot of games that I don't play anymore. Oh, and speaking of games that we don't play anymore, apparently Wasteland 3 had DLC. But, yeah, I doubt we're gonna play it. No. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of Rahala, Pinball, fucking Lego Batman, fucking Black Ops. Well, not Black Ops, but I'll get rid of, like. Uh, I'll give it a check in because I don't play check in on my account. Uh, uh, do I really 
want Destiny 2? I'm not gonna play Destiny 2. Okay. Yeah. The Salas and I are like trying to get Anthony to play it, but I don't think he's interested. Which is okay. Anthony said that if um, Silas gives him a, a rogue with mm -hmm. it, then yeah. <laughs> think, of, think of the children exists. Oh, I love that game. I love Think of the Children. <laughs> Remember the spaceship and Anthony? <laughs> I did it one of us accidentally like suplex Anthony off of like like down a hole or something. Yeah. Like picked him up and ran off the edge with him. Me <laughs> too. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh they're deleting I like how in the middle of my stream I'm just deleting games. <laughs> <laughs> like anything they the playing this game. That barely put a fucking dent in my thing. Damn, all those games gone and barely put a dent? Damn. I'm down to 1.93. Damn. It kinda... Eh. Alright, let's restart this damn fucking scavenge. But also, uh... I'm so close to beating it. I'm so close to beating it. It's just minimal mistakes that I'm making that are so major. I know, right? Like, if you walk into a room and there aren't any cans in it, that small hesitation costs you the run. Or if you bump into a suitcase, because if you sprint without hitting anything, you'll speed boost. And if you knock into a sofa or something, it, like, takes away that speed boost. It's so annoying. But also, Wendy, as soon as Neo 2 is done installing, I'm gonna I'm gonna make a new character and stream it so that you, you can see my suffering. I'm just gonna I think I have Neo in my mom's room. Oh, uh first one or second one? Both. Both, okay, so uh, but uh, but sadly how how the games co op work is stupid. Cause Oh, the only way that you and I can play together is if either of us beat the boss and then help the other one, because you can only cooperate in uh, an area. Oh, it's the same thing like Talkaiden. Yeah, you can only cooperate in an area if the other person has already beat the boss. Oh, and... fuck! I ran into the wrong room! Uh, how much did that... I have four down. I have four cans. Shit. Wait, hold on. Um... I'm very happy with my Vincent Van Gogh sweater. Oh, do you... uh, is it like a fuzzy sweater, or is this is like is it a thick? It's a th it's a thin sweater that you could just chill out around the house in. You know, it's like a lounge mm -hmm. sweater. Uh, it's not it's not heavy enough for you to get hot as fuck, but it's thick enough. That you just stay warm. Mm -hmm. But if you're going up against San Francisco winds, nah. <laughs> That's not going <laughs> to keep you warm. <laughs> Learn that the hard way. Oh. Hmm. So, Neo, so because people were unhappy with how Neo 1 did its co op, they changed how the co op works in Neo 2. And we can oh. co-op to and we can co-op together without either of us having killed the boss. Oh, cool! Finally. Damn! Imagine getting bullied by your fan base. <laughs> the the only caveat into um, the only caveat to inviting someone is the person summoning. So, so let's say I'm summoning you. I have to have a ochoco cup. And the only way to get a Ochoco Cup is to summon a ghost and fight the ghost. And if you kill it, you'll get an Ochoco Cup. Problem is, those ghosts belong to players. So, you have to do PvP to be able to play PvE with your, with your homie. Oh. But, but thankfully for you, I'm pretty damn good at the, at the PvP in Neo. So, I can just hoard Ochoco Cups. Yeah, so, you down to work with Neo, then? Mm, we have a lot of games that we're playing. 
Yeah. Uh, I think about it. But for now, I'll say yes. For now, I'll say yes. Because I am reinstalling it because I want to find out. I want to get my revenge on that boss. <laughs> that best. I like how it never occurred to you that I walk in with... He plays me. Uh-huh. Like... It never occurred to you that you could just change your fucking weapon before you walk in there? Yeah. Or, like, at least have him fight with a weapon that sucks. Like the axe. The axe sucks. Okay, uh, Okay. actually, I shouldn't say that, because the axe is good against a weapon that can't parry. But because the, the uh, katana is, is all about parrying, the axe is easy to fight against. But anyways... I Yo, have... walk in with the fucking axe! Exactly, I should have walked in with an axe as my secondary, and then swapped to my katana primary as soon as he copies me. Son of a bitch. Oh my... Cause... Oh, and the axe is I feel slow. like you're having galaxy brain right now. <laughs> I feel like... And, and it's only because of you, like, the whole world is open in front of me, like, yo, I can finally play past that boss. I can finally finish the game. <laughs> past that boss. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, but the... Oh, but... If the two of us fight that boss, will there be two of them, and we each have to fight a version of ourselves? I, I bet there's gonna be two of them. There's no uh, fucking way that I wouldn't. Yeah, because from what I've read, from what people have said from playing co-op with each other on Neo, too, mm -hmm. is that when uh, because they made co-op easier to do, um, when you summon your friend, the the uh, game changes like the amount of enemies will befit mm -hmm. two people and bosses uh -huh. are going to be more aggressive and will have more health and some bosses are just different so uh -huh. so, so the two of us <laughs> we're going to have a good time in Neo and by a good time I mean absolute suffering because <laughs> there is early on a boss um, have Have you played Neo 2? no oh okay so uh, is it okay if I can spoil this? go ahead uh, early on in the game, there's a boss that's a vampire that uses lightning to fight you. Ah! <gasps> How close were you? Two cans. Uh, oh, oh, Vundy. <laughs> you were so close. As soon as my Neo is done installing, I actually know. I can't abandon you. I need to keep going. I can't okay. abandon you. Go, go, V. Go, V. That monster. One of us has to have a victory. <laughs> One of us <laughs> One has, of to, us have has to have a victory. <laughs> so, but, but what sucks is I didn't, I or I wasn't able to carry my Neo Two saves over from my PS4, so I need to go through the entire game again to get to that asshole. But that boss is at the halfway point of the game, so I'll get there soon. I'll get there soon. Oh. One of us just needs a victory. And if it can't be me, it must be you, Martin. <laughs> oh, but, um, do you want to hear an another story of a boss fight? Go ahead. So, this boss fight comes from, um, Dark Souls 3, and you want- <laughs> Grab that bitch and let's go! <laughs> You know what? I'll I'll finish this stream 